Hey, sales managers and business owners. In this video, I'm gonna talk about what to look for when recruiting and hiring salespeople. Now, what most companies do, what most hiring managers, sales managers, recruiters, HR, what they do is they look for experience. They get the resume, they go through it and they say, this person has or does not have what we need and it's got, um, this person's got the credentials. They've got the background, they've got enough experience, let's move forward. In a lot of situations, the hiring manager is a sales manager, is a ex salesperson, and what they're doing is looking for people who had the experience that they had because they think that their path is the right way to go. Um, I think some experience is good. I think having the ability to sell versus teaching someone everything about sales is important. Where that comes from, that's a different matter. For me, here's my perspective. After hiring and dealing with a lot of salespeople in so many different industries before consulting and even now across a whole bunch of different industries for my clients is what i know is that you can teach somebody your product you can even teach them some sales skills you can improve on that you can help them get better at sales but what you can't teach somebody really quick enough is how to be a good salesperson, how to be a good fit for what your company needs and what it does and for the type of conversations they have and what you need as a innate skill, let's say an ability that they should have with them. That's why for me, and I wrote this as a chapter in my Selling with Authentic Persuasion book, is focusing on these sales success traits. When, a, when you're hiring and recruiting, these traits are really what you wanna look for. First, experience is second. And those five traits are openness, curiosity, creativity, persistence, and authenticity. And those are so important. When you're recruiting, what you wanna do is you want to set up your questions, your tests, even traps, in order to identify people who have what you're looking for in terms of openness, curiosity, creativity, persistence, and authenticity. You wanna identify how people naturally operate. A lot of people will show you who they are when they don't think you're looking. That's why the standard interview questions that everyone prepares for and actually has answers for, those are useless because everyone already has a canned answer. What you want to do is you want to just throw random things at them. That's why I help companies build different kind of interview processes and the whole thing from the beginning to the end, trying to identify people who have the right mix and the right level of those five sales success traits. What you wanna do is you wanna to try to test them, you wanna look for it, make sure they're not looking for it. One of my friends, I've learned this a long time ago, what he says is hire the smile, train the skill. You can always teach someone your product, you can teach them the job, you can teach them how to make widgets, sell widgets, anything like that, if they have some basic understanding. What you can't do is you can't train someone to have a good personality, to be open, to be curious. They have to bring that, then you can teach them the rest. Hopefully this helps in your recruiting, especially in this year that we have on the backs of a challenging year in 2022 for recruiting. 2023 is going to be the same, if not more difficult. And so what you want to do is get it, get good at hiring the right people. Because when you do, you don't have turnover like most sales organizations do. And then you can just keep growing and building instead of filling and then losing and then replacing.